This is a demonstration video of the function of this particular Nagra 3, number 8607. The Nagra 3 introduced servo controlled uh, motor inside which kept the speed constant regardless of what the machine was doing physically, within reason of course, but if you play back a tone and move the machine around you'll hear that the tone stays constant. So the tachometer and the um, servo systems are working correctly on this Nagra. Now we'll do a record test. We'll plug in a microphone to the record jack here. We'll put it into test and we can see that when we turn the volume up and I talk into the mic that the meter is functioning. It's quite loud at this point. I'll turn it down some. So there you see the meter working and the modulometer was very special as far as these machines go because it grabbed peaks and held on to them so you could see what the true peak reading was on your meter. So if I hit a pop, the meter will grab it and hold it. Pop, pop. And when we go into record, this is the transport function. We click it into place and we'll go into hi-fi record. So now we're recording at 7.5 IPS and the meter is moving. You don't see a flag on this speed meter because that detected whether or not there was pilot tone that recorded into the center head. Pilot tone had to be um, supplied externally and was a means of resolving the uh, tape speed to very accurate uh, specifications for sync in film use. So when I go to um, automatic record, the input volume has no effect on the meter. The meter continues to bounce even though the in mic input is all the way down. So it has a great um, automatic gain control or compression or limiting action that also sounds really good. When I put it back into hi-fi record then I'm responsible for recording the uh, or setting the level and you can see I can either overdrive it or keep it at a reasonable level. Now, of course, the vast amount of headrooms that uh, these Nagras had um, let you record a very hot signal and have it still sound clean. Now we'll play back through the speaker. So I'll shut the Nagra off. We'll rewind. Hit the power. As you can see, it rewinds really well. And was a means of resolving the uh, tape speed. Now the volume um, on the internal speaker is currently controlled with the line and playback yes. knob over here. So when I go to um, automatic record, the input volume has no effect on the meter. You also notice that the meter is reflecting battery power at this point. The in mic input is all the way down, so it has a great... When you go to hi-fi playback, the actual... Uh, playback is responding, but of course we can't hear it because in hi-fi playback output is only available through the jacks here or through the side output there. But at a reasonable level. Now, of course the vast amount of headrooms that uh, these Nagras had um, let you record a very hot signal and have it still sound clean. Now we'll play back through this. This has had the, um, the pinch roller replaced and has been thoroughly checked out for functionality and cleaned up and is in excellent condition Nagra 3.